lung cancer clinical trials and the U.S. black community. More than 46 million people in the United States identify themselves as black or African American. In this video, we will use the word black as many people use it to describe a community as well as a specific ancestry. For black men in the U.S., lung cancer is the leading cause of death from cancer. It is the second for black women. More U.S. black men die from lung cancer each year than men from any other group. More black women die of lung cancer than Asian and Pacific Islander or Hispanic and Latina women. Black people with lung cancer tend to do as well as those from other groups when they receive the same treatments. However, they often have less access to lung cancer treatment. They tend to have surgery, an effective treatment for early stage lung cancer, less often. Early diagnosis and effective treatment are important for survival and quality of life. Researchers are working hard to develop new ways to screen for, diagnose, and treat lung cancer for everyone. However, they need more black people to join lung cancer research studies called clinical trials. Right now, few black people volunteer for clinical trials. Therefore, researchers cannot gather important information about the best screening and most effective treatment options for blacks. Black people are 12 to 14 percent of the U.S. population, but make up just 5 percent of those in cancer clinical trials. This is not enough to truly represent black people and develop treatments that work well for their genetic makeup. Too few black people in clinical trials means tests and treatments may not be optimal for people with this genetic makeup. For example, a test to measure a woman's risk of breast cancer was only checked for accuracy with white volunteers. If black women had been available and included, the test would be more accurate for all women, including black women. Lack of trust in the medical system is one reason few black people join clinical trials. Many remember the U.S. Public Health Service's study of syphilis in black men who did not give consent or receive effective treatment. They also know about cases where research profited by taking black people's tissue without their consent. Other reasons include black people not qualifying because of physical characteristics or health problems and living far from trial sites that going there is inconvenient or expensive. Many black people's doctors do not tell them about trials or ask if they want to join. This is sometimes because the doctors do not have enough information. It is important to ask your doctor or healthcare team about joining clinical trials. Participants of clinical trials may receive many potential benefits. A trial may allow you to try a treatment that is not yet available to the public. You benefit the black community by helping researchers learn how treatments work for people with your genetic makeup. The treatment may be helpful or extend your life, and you will receive medical care even if you do not get the trial treatment, so there is no risk of going without treatment. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration, or FDA, has a list of questions to ask before joining a clinical trial. Questions include, what is the purpose of this clinical trial? Will I be paid? And can I leave at any time? Today, U.S. research laws require researchers to explain trials completely, answer your questions, and get written consent before you join. You can leave the trial at any time. Trials involve some risk for everyone. You may not receive the treatment you hope for, or it may not work as well as you would like. You may also experience discomfort or pain during treatment. Ask your cancer specialist about the risks and benefits of a clinical trial. You may want to talk with your primary care doctor if you have a closer relationship. Research shows many potential benefits for black people who take part in clinical trials. Feel free to talk with family members, friends, people in your community, or perhaps your pastor before deciding to join a trial. In the United States, you can search for a trial that makes sense for your specific case at researchmatch.org, funded by the NCI, 
or at abreathofhope.org forward slash clinical dash trials. To learn more about clinical trials for lung cancer, visit youandlungcancer.com.